All right, well, 16 days, regional, national, international performers. It is a festival like no other. And this past weekend, it kicked off. Of course, we're talking about the Columbia Festival of the Arts. And world-renowned artist Alex DeGrassi is here. Thank you so much for coming in. Thanks for having me. How long have you been playing? Wow. Uh, well, I started when I was about 12 years old, which was back in, somewhere back in the 60s. <laughs> was this one of those things where somebody said, why don't you play guitar? Did you hear somebody that inspired you? How did you get to where you are now? You know, I played trumpet in the school bands and orchestras, and my mother came home one day with a guitar for my older brother, because he liked to sing and sang in the glee club and all that, so uh, she thought he'd, like, pick it up and accompany himself. Well, I, after about a week, I decided it was my instrument, so that was it for my brother, but the guitar was mine, and I gave away the trumpet and just started playing guitar. And you said, describe to me your, your pick list. I w I'm not really that familiar with um, guitar playing, but you said that you, and you are described, not by you, but by other people, as one of the best in the world for the type of style that you play. People use the term finger style, meaning uh, in this case I'm using my right hand to, to pluck the strings. Okay. As opposed to using a flat pick and strumming. And uh, there's kind of a whole genre now of people playing solo or even singer-songwriters who might be playing and it's kind of a mixture of a lot of different styles. Folk, a little bit of folk, a little bit of jazz, a little bit of classical guitar, and so uh, people call it finger style. So. Now I know that you're from San Francisco. You have um, you've never been to the the festival no. that's going on, but it's incredible. Are you excited about it? And what you're doing is kind of cool. So tell us what you're doing because it's different. Right. I'm going to be performing tonight a live score for a Japanese film, a silent film made in 1934 by Yasujiro Ozu. I was commissioned to write and perform the score originally in 2006 at the New York Guitar Festival. And uh, in the past year, I've had some more opportunities to perform this, so I've um, actually got quite a few concerts now doing this. I wrote the score. I've written a lot of themes. The movie is 84 minutes long, uh, so there's also room for improvisation within that film. So every time I perform it, it's a little bit different. And uh, it's a stunning film. Uh, the photography is really uh, spectacular. Uh, it's hard to believe it was made in 1934. Well, all this is happening in Colombia. We want to hear you play. We're going to put the information up on your screen. The festival goes on for a while, so you have an opportunity. But this definitely seems like something interesting to see. So yeah. would you mind playing something for us? I will. I'll just right. play a, a little tune that's called uh, Mr. B Takes a Walk in the Rain. Okay, great.
Brooklyn. Wow, <laughs> thank you so much. Great. All right. So again, Columbia Festival of the Arts, it's 16 days. It started on the 11th. You can hear Alex play. There's so much great stuff going on down there. Thank you so much for coming in. I know that you're tired. A uh, little bit of jet lag coming I'm, in from San Francisco. I'm, I'm up. <laughs> you did a wonderful job. It didn't sound like it at all. It sounded beautiful. Thanks. All right, if you need more information on the festival, we'll put it on our website, abc2news.com. We'll be right back.